clear that the investment agenda into European research infrastructure, which now exceeds 24 billion, comes also with societal responsibility and expectations, which go well beyond just fundamental research. In this broader discussion with the stakeholders, we should take into consideration stakeholders that they are representing communities that from climate, from energy, from health, from digital. So interactions and collaboration also with the EOSC, the work that was done in the EOSC, so that what we deliver will be really on the top of what are the challenges that we have today. It is quite unique and has a lot of potential to facilitate communication within research infrastructure world. There is a need for the future to have a better link between the ARIs and the, and the stakeholder. Our expectation is to what extent can national facilities, which are not as free projects, but are still really relevant in the overall landscape, how can we engage, how can we contribute to the discussions? Being here is very important because we can have dialogue with our fellow uh, partners, uh, fellow runners of uh, research infrastructures. Uh, learn about best practice examples that we exchange on how to overcome especially crisis situations like the, the energy crisis of the finance, our research infrastructures and how to provide open access. From a research infrastructure's point of view, uh, what I'm also looking for is helping determine the unknown unknown users. So we we constantly try to reach out to new potential users. Uh, we have target audience, target users in areas that we're aware of. But the big challenge for us is how could we extend our research infrastructures to parts of the community who have never experienced them before that we're unaware of. I would expect that S3 actively engaged and I invite you to do so with EOSC, the partnership and our collaboration with the member states that we call a tripartite collaboration. So I'm looking forward to a very um, extensive dialogue. Dialogue and communication is vitally important. It's not enough uh, between research infrastructures, between research infrastructures and funders, between research infrastructures and the community that they will serve and how they will enable the community. S3 Stakeholder Forum will bring together various uh, stakeholders on various initiatives such as, for example, uh, uh, representatives from ministries, different ministries from different sectors regions, uh, missions, uh, industrial technology roadmaps, uh, universities, industries and other stakeholders with research infrastructure. Push them out of their comfort zone and start discussing what could be the new services, improved services that will add the value of research infrastructure to our society. And this is exactly what we need at this point. It's a complex world and we need complex solutions.